Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're gonna to show you how to set up the Blink Outdoor Camera. So this is the 2021, 2020 version of the Blink Outdoor Camera and moving forwards. In order to get this set up, what you're gonna to need to do is download the Blink app and create an account. They have that available both on iOS and Android. What's really cool about this Blink Outdoor Camera, the newer generation, is that it is battery powered, but you can also plug it into a power adapter if you wanna have it hardwired and powered up and not worry about the batteries. But what's even cooler about this is that when you have this adapter that converts the video signal into Wi-Fi, this will allow you to store your video on the cloud, but it also allows for local storage on a USB drive that just plugs in right here on the side. So that's really nice because if you use that USB drive, you don't have to pay for any kind of monthly storage cost for the Blink camera, really nice feature there. So in order to get this set up, the very first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and create an account. So let's go down here, click on create an account, and now we just need to select our country. So I'm gonna go ahead and click next here. I am in the United States. It says choose your region, central, east, or west. We are central, so I'm gonna click okay here. And now we just need to enter our email address. So go ahead and do that now. Once you've got your email address entered, go ahead and click next. Now go ahead and create a password. Now, once you've created a password, it's going to ask you to verify your email address. So go ahead and do that. Enter the code that was just sent. Enter the code and click verify. Now enter your phone number. Click next. Now enter the code that you just got a text message from. And go ahead and verify that code. It says, have an Amazon account? Now you can link it to Blink. This brings your features that combine the strengths of Amazon and Blink to improve the experience. More features are coming soon, so link your accounts today. We're gonna go ahead and skip this for now, but we do have a video that shows you how to link Blink to Amazon Alexa. Now we need to choose what we're going to install. So the first thing we're gonna install is the Blink wireless camera system. So that is the sync module that we've got right here. So you can see this sync module here. And what we're gonna to need to do is plug this in to a power adapter and get this set up. So let's go ahead and do that now. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on Blink wireless camera system. And we've got the included power adapter here and we've got that all set up. So we're gonna go ahead and plug that in in a moment here. It says capture the QR device or enter the serial number manually. So underneath this blue tape here, that is where your QR code is. So you're gonna go ahead and scan that. So go ahead and take your phone and then scan that QR code on the back of the device. Once you scan the QR code, it says sync module, a system or group of cameras that can be armed, disarmed, or scheduled together. There is a limit of one sync module per system, so we're gonna go ahead and give this system a name. Let's just call this Blink Outdoor Cameras. Then go ahead and click Next. It says, plug in the device and wait for it to be ready. When ready, the lights will display a blinking blue and then steady green. So now we're gonna go ahead and plug this in and that's right where that power adapter goes. So make sure you take off this plastic wrap that goes around the outside. And now we're gonna go ahead and plug the power adapter in here. And then we're going to go ahead and plug in the other end of the power adapter to an outlet. All right, now we've got it plugged in and we've currently got a blue light. So let's see if it goes through the process here. We need to wait for a blinking blue and steady green. Now the blink sync module is blinking blue and we've got the steady green light. So we're gonna go ahead and click discover device. It says when prompted, tap connect once to blink as it appears. It may take a few seconds for the blink to appear. I'm going to go ahead and click okay here. Now it's looking for the device to use with Blink down here at the bottom. So when it appears, we're going to click connect. Then we click on our Blink device right here and it will connect. Now we need to choose our Wi-Fi network. So go ahead and do that and you're gonna then need to enter your password. Now we go ahead and click join. 
It says updating the sync module firmware. Do not unplug the sync module. It says sync module connected successfully. Go ahead and click done. Now our sync module is connected, we're ready to go ahead and connect the camera. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the plus symbol up here in the upper right hand corner. Now let's go ahead and choose a Blink wireless camera. Now it says capture the QR code on the device or enter the serial number manually. So we've got our Blink outdoor camera right here. And as you can see, there is no serial number on the outside of this device. We got to open it up in order to get to that. So go ahead and take all the plastic off of this first, and then we're going to need to go ahead and open it up. So, so let's go ahead and get these off here. And we're also going to take the plastic off the back here. All right. Now we've got this little plastic here. Let's take this off. And what we need to do is access the inside of the device so you can take out that little plug there. And then there is a tool included and we're gonna use that to unscrew the back of the Blink Outdoor camera. So just take that tool, you wanna use the little pointy end and you're just going to unscrew that. So uh, you're gonna unscrew it counterclockwise. All right, once we've got it unscrewed counterclockwise, we can just lift up and then that's going to expose the serial number and the QR code. So just go ahead and tilt that cover up and the QR code is right underneath this blue tape, which is what we're going to scan. So go ahead, take your camera and you're going to scan that QR code right there. Once we scan the QR code, it asks us to add the Blink Outdoor Camera to an existing system. So we set up that Blink Outdoor Cameras group with the sync module here, so we would go ahead and choose that. However, before I do that, what I like to do is typically take the batteries and go ahead and install them in the Blink Camera or the Blink Outdoor Camera. So it comes with two batteries here. You wanna make sure you put Energizer Ultimate Lithium in there. And that's just because those are the ones that are designed to make it last for two years. So let's go ahead and we're gonna put our one battery in here and we're gonna take our other battery and we're gonna go ahead and put that one in as well. So let's see, that is how the battery goes. So we've got a plus symbol down here on the left side and we've got a plus symbol up here on the right side of the battery. And now we're gonna go ahead and we can just tilt this back into place. So what I like to do is it kind of tilts into place and then you press down and then you're gonna take your tool and you're gonna go ahead and secure this. So screw that in nice and tight. You don't want any water to get in there if it's gonna be outside in the elements. So now I'm gonna go ahead and click Blink Outdoor Cameras right here. And it says looking for your camera. So now it's gonna start looking for that camera and try to connect to it. It says camera added successfully. So I'm gonna go ahead and click done here. It says your device comes with free trial of cloud storage. We're gonna go ahead and click done here. Now it says your new camera includes a speaker enabling two-way communication. Hold down the talk button during a live view session to talk, release to listen. I'm gonna go ahead and click okay. And now let's go ahead and tilt the camera up and see what we see. And before we go ahead and install this somewhere, uh, you do have this piece on the back here that you can insert there. But the other part to this is we actually have a mount. So we're gonna go ahead and install this on the mount so you can see how that works. But uh, before we do that, let's go ahead and see if the live view works of this. So let's see if we can just get a shot of the desk here. Click on that and it'll take a picture. Or if we wanted to click on the camera icon over here, that would take a video recording. So you can see we got a little shot of the desk there and what is going on. But now let's go ahead and if we wanna start a live view, let's go ahead and click on this and then it is going to have the live view. Let's see, I've got my hand in front of the camera here so you can see what's going on. So it's pretty real time, um, takes probably maybe one or two seconds in delay. We could go ahead and talk if we wanted here. We could click save or we could discard. I'm just gonna go ahead and discard this for now. And then we're gonna go back and let's go ahead and let's try and mount this camera. So uh, see how this is gonna work. We're gonna go find a location outside and mount this camera. But essentially, now we are done setting up our Blink Outdoor Camera here. 
You can see it, it is currently working and we've got it set up on the app. So if you wanna place it some other way and you don't wanna use one of these adapters, let's say you just wanna put this in a planner box, you are good to go. This Blink Outdoor camera is set up. So go ahead and give us that thumbs up, subscribe, or click any links below if you wanna support us. Now, if you wanna see us install it on the adapter, keep watching here and we will show you how to do that now. So now we're outside and we're gonna go ahead and install this Blink camera on the side of this fence. And what you need is the mount and the two screws that it comes with. And then this mount just has a ball joint and that will rotate so you can position the camera up or down or left or right. And then the camera actually just pushes right into that ball joint like so, so you just press it into place. So we're ready to go ahead and mount the camera. I'm just gonna put it right here and you wanna make sure to give yourself enough room to let it tilt up or down without any interference. So we go ahead and screw these two screws in and we also wanna make sure that we're not mounting it too high so that the motion detection isn't gonna be activated. So the motion detection is about 20 feet. I typically recommend mounting these at about eight or nine feet. So just out of the reach of most people or out of the view of most people. However, uh, that's really up to you. You're gonna have them on video if they're trying to take your Blink camera, so you're good with that anyways. And then go ahead and just screw these two screws in. Obviously, it's gonna be easier if you've got a drill driver, but we're gonna go ahead and just finish it up with a screwdriver, because that's what I've got here with me. So get this all the way 100% screwed in. All right, now we've got the mount screwed into place, so we're just gonna take our Blink camera and push it onto the mount. So take the camera, and align the hole on the back of the camera with the mount and then just push it into place. All right, now we are complete with our installation and setup of the Blink camera. And you can go ahead and position this and rotate it up, you can rotate it down, or you can rotate it left, or you can rotate it right. So thank you for watching this video on how to set up your Blink outdoor camera or how to install your Blink outdoor camera please go ahead, give us that thumbs up, subscribe, and click any of the links below if you want to support us. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.